Are you still in LA right now? Technically, yeah. Technically, I mean, I'm, you're I'm home road, three days right? a week, uh, three days a month, maybe. You're just constantly touring. Yeah, it's a dream come true, man. Yeah. Careful what you wish for. But long time coming, you know. Well, I don't know. It's not careful what you wish for. It's just you just have to learn how to manage this new thing now. It's great though. It's not careful. It's fucking awesome. It's so much better than it not working out for you. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> no, if I could sleep like a normal human being, I think I'd be just fine. Yeah, you you were, were just talking about that. You have serious insomnia. Yeah. Have you done anything to try to mitigate that? Have you done? Have you taken melatonin? Have you oh, tried dude, any yeah. herbal? Th- have you done all that I've, stuff? I've o- OD'd on Nothing. melatonin, dude. I've taken thirty milligrams in a night, and you know you build up a tolerance to melatonin, yeah. and you have to stop using it for a little while. I mean, I do have to smoke like every single night to even have a chance of falling asleep wow so you just like get some of that be real indica some of that cypress oh, hill yeah. shit <laughs> dude until i just am just <laughs> deformed in bed <laughs> and that puts you out God, not really oh, no wow. dude it's insane i can stay awake on on xanax and everything it's almost so like interesting if you picture a, like a like a light switch to mm-hmm. turn your brain off i just can't it's your like switch doesn't work no and i, I think it's like after thinking about it for years, I think it's the same mechanism in my brain that like allows me to think quickly on stage mm. that allows that keeps my brain up at night. Like I just think about anything. It's not right. even anxiety. It's just anything. It's just f- frantic thoughts just bouncing around your head. Yeah. Anything from middle school memories to like, man, it's crazy how leaves are green and then brown sometimes. Like it's just <laughs> fucking anything. My dick is like, please don't beat me again. <laughs> like I've tried everything. Tried man. everything. I promise. Wow. I know. I know. It's it sucks because obviously, I mean, sleep for as much as I work out, like your muscles don't get that time to recover because mm-hmm. they can't build. Well, and your brain doesn't get that time to recover. Oh, yeah. Your immune system suffers. Everything suffers when you don't sleep. I've made like a really conscious effort over the last year to get a lot of sleep. And I've fucked it up quite a few times with the club because there's been times with the club where like at least three nights a week when I'm performing, you know, I'm out till two o'clock in the morning. Mm-hmm. And generally I wake up around eight to start working out. And at, you know, at eight, it's like six hours. It's not quite enough. Yeah. Like, it's not even six hours. It's like five and a half. And, you know, I feel tired. I look tired. And it, I just don't have as much juice. And then when I adjust and then get proper sleep again, it's all of a sudden it's like, mm. like, I feel like everything turns up to 10 again. It's fascinating. Like, I feel a big difference. Like, physically feel a big difference. Like, if that, if sleep was a supplement, if I could take a sleep supplement mm-hmm. and it gives you that feeling you get when you're like fully rested, uh-huh. oh my God, you're just better. You're better. Everything works better. Your brain works better. You're, 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 you can physically do more. Everything just, works better. I've heard. Yeah, you gotta try it. <laughs> I don't think I've even been in a REM sleep. In five years, dude. Oh, that doesn't make sense. It's you so would, you'd not be dead. Good. I, I you'd feel dead. dead, dude. But you're not. You feel alive. I've you're... stayed awake for nine straight days before. What? Yeah. I don't even think that's possible. I think the world record is like 11 or 13. Because I looked into it because I genuinely started to get like fearful for my own health. Do you, Jesus Christ. Do, you, do you agree with having needing eight hours? Because I've heard in so many different no, theories. No, I don't think I don't think everybody needs eight hours. I just know I do. There's no way I could know what's going on in other people's bodies. You think it's case by case? Yeah, I think it's like everything with biology. Biology varies so much by genetics and life experiences. And you know, like what what have you done leading up? Have you just been sedentary your whole life, or you've Mm. been very active? Is your body very fit, or is your body like riddled with problems? Like, there's so many, and they're just genetics, man. They vary so much. Some people are, you know, they have no problem with five hour sleep. And it changes over time as well, doesn't it? Like, didn't people evolve from sleeping in like four hour increments or something like that? I mean, I'm sure they did. I'm sure they didn't get a chance to just fucking chill. Mm, you know, they were getting yeah. eaten by cats. Yeah. You know, that's the, you know, the, the rub on people. It's like we still have these genetics that are from 10,000, 15,000 years ago when life was very different. Mm-hmm. And those are still the same genetics. And that's yeah. why we're still looking for like tribal leaders and shit. We're yeah. looking for like a president, a prime minister. We're looking <laughs> yeah. for like one person. 